NFTs <clears throat> basically redefine how you own digital assets. It is a sphere within which sphere of expression that can extend um, the artist's ability to create and get rewarded from his uh, creation. Right now, in the market as we're speaking, in the NFT industry, uh, a lot of people that you see making the money and uh, getting revenue from their works are largely digital artists. I think the best way to push, uh, to make it more mainstream, is to build, consciously build an ecosystem of uh, different creatives from different backgrounds. When artists leave school, they never get to spend time in studio again together. There are very few studios that actually accommodate artists and the way they spend a lot of time. So residences afford them the time to spend together and to, like musicians, jam together. And in rubbing minds, they pick up a whole lot of things. In spending time together, they, they influence each other. And then if you have a mentor or a facilitator who you know, is able to guide, the things you would have, that would have taken you maybe five years to pick up, you can pick up in two weeks. These young artists, are, from my own point of view, have incredible talent. They probably are more talented than when I was as a kid, you know, as a young man, and they could do so much more. And even on the first day, the drawings changed. The next day, they picked up a few other things. So now this is the fourth day, and I'm actually, I am the one that's marveled at how much they've picked up. Now, I'm, you know, most of the work I do is just supervise. You know, and they've done quite a bit, you know, with what they've learned.